Hi guys, PJ here and we're back with another Atom Store Showcase. This is an absolute bumper week. I mean, you've got to check this bundle out. We'll be showing you in detail what all this stuff looks like. 1,400 Atoms and you are going to get the, well, mobile home trailer that you see right there. We'll have a look inside that shortly. The hot tub, that was the killer for me. I had to get it for the hot tub, I mean look at that we'll have a look at that in action see it working the nice red brick wall that you see there we have a matching floor milled brick floor there quite a nice one i was more bothered about the wall i think than the floor but still it's another addition and you also come with the rustic room divider now that's a bit of a changed theme on we've already had one we had a wooden one earlier quite a decorative one and this is more of a a rough edged one if you like but still it's another addition six pack loot bag that's a bit of a weird one isn't it so it's a six pack so when you die or whatever and you drop your loot bag you can drop this one if you set it to that so this is the bundle that we're going to be going over guys it's the comforts of home vacation at home one there you go at the top look so we'll have a look at that but also i just want to briefly mention if we go all the way across to the end we've got for fallout first members this is a survival tent guys this apc is a survival tent the thing that makes this unique is the fact it's actually got a tinker's workbench inside it so in other words you can scrap all the weapons and stuff that you actually pick up while you're in game which is fantastic because the normal tents haven't got that the normal tents have just got the sleeping bag haven't they and the stash box and stuff this has got a tinker's bench in it as well as a fallout first box at the entrance to it so pretty good it's also got a bed in there as well nice bit of kit that is very very useful i've already been using it i think it's brilliant and we have this mask on offer at 150 so that's pretty cheap what else we got anything of interest while i'm here very very quickly we got a little bit of money off the atrium it's 1440 so it's still pretty expensive in my opinion i was hoping for it to be a bit cheaper than that when they started reducing the shelters but you know it's a start there it is but guys let's get into it let's have a look at this bundle see what it looks like actually in-game built up so just briefly here we go here's the new tent have a really quick look at this guys you're going to see tons of these they are going to be really popular so we've got a full out first scrap box at the start a cooker a tinker bench that's the bit i think is fantastic and a bed so pretty useful there you go there's the rest of it should we have a look around the outside of it now there's not a normal scrap box so this is clearly aimed at fallout first members there we go let's go and have a look there we go check that out i actually wish the tracks were intact and not dilapidated but you can't have everything can you so you get your own apc i think that's really nice if you go on top of it which yeah i have done already look at that you got some little little hatches there and everything on it nice big gun on the top shame it doesn't work but hey so there we go that's that bit guys that's... okay guys here's your new wall and gate pieces now funnily enough these are actually under defense okay so you've got a couple of categories there and as you can see we've got one gate double gates and some longer wall sections like so but we've also got short wall sections look there you got little pillars and some smaller ones so that's that bit can we open them oh get attacked typical there we go better go and deal with these nice little intruders now well here we have the caravan lots of broken windows boarded up windows all the windows are boarded up by the look of things apart from the smashed ones of course quite raidery could go quite well with the um, mining bundle that they've just had up quite an interesting one that it's quite small you get a bed in it a couple of chairs maybe a table or you could put crafting in it but it's quite deceiving in this workshop it looks quite small but putting this in my camp it was really huge couldn't do it that's why i'm here i also tried in some of the uh, shelters even the bigger ones and uh, yeah it won't fit in them either so this thing is pretty big 
there you go inside and out that's what it looks like it is on stilts and they do you know you can raise it up substantially the steps are quite high on it so if you want to raise it up a little bit more you can do but guys that's that bit now let's let's get onto that hot tub and have a look see ya And there we go we can actually sit and relax in the pool check that out guys now let's see if the pool can take two i reckon it can okay let's do this soak option there not sit option oh it doesn't seem to be working No, Bethesda, you have got something wrong. It doesn't appear to work when there's somebody already in it. Oh, guys, fatal. There's two seats. But we can't sit down. Check that out. Let's just leave it for a minute, so if it resets. No, no good. No good. Hmm, bit of a bug there, Bethesda. Anyway, guys, let's have a look at this thing. So we've got basically an old wood construction. The edges have got some damage, as you can see there. There's some bits and bobs shattered on it. Look at this, we've got like a little boiler at the side of it there. Where the water comes out steam coming out the top of it it's a nice little trick it's a steam powered one i guess but yeah overall a really really nice little bundle we've got going on here guys just a shame there's a borg or a problem at the moment and we can't actually sit two people on there clearly is two seats as you can see glad we tried that out that is a bit of a problem hopefully it's a patch thing and they can fix that but at the moment yeah it's got a problem i like it but that could do with fixing. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. Bye for now.